Hey y'all, happy Friday. Uh, this is actually not a happy Friday video, but it is Friday, so I figured I'd say happy Friday, y'all. This is actually an unboxing video. Yay, we got a package in from Peter Fox. Thank you, Peter. All right, y'all might remember the video where I showed off my new Lishy brace and put keys in right here and use it as a guide to clip keys out with the Lishy hand cutter. This thing actually, um, I did it in the video when we got it and it worked great. And I've actually used it three times in the field and it has worked uh, great enough. Uh, one time that was a little tight, uh, but I had to kind of manipulate the key a little bit to make it work. Um, but all three times it actually did exactly what it needed to do and it helped me uh, get past a dead ball like I had a door lock on one where the door lock I was able to take it apart and then just open the dead bolt uh, But I just wanted to point that out again. Thanks again Peter for that And also he had most recently I didn't do a video on this, but he had most recently sent me uh, another awesome package and uh, so yes that one had I actually did an unboxing video on it, but I never I never uploaded it. But if I look down in my electrical toolkit here that I've been using, uh, he knew he had seen me buy uh, a cheaper, like I think it was a client version of these, and he sent me a couple of the automatic wire strippers, so I was able to return the one that he said was not any good, and uh, I was able to use these, and also a nice pair of cutters and uh, some taps as well, which I have still over here. I've not had a chance to use any of the taps, uh, but he sent me some really nice, uh, a nice selection of these Hurtle. He said these were much better taps than these crap things that you get at, you know, box stores or whatever. So I can't wait to try these taps for sure. Got a couple in all the common sizes the locksmiths use um, and then the clippers and cutters I'll go ahead and show you uh, the fun things these I, I use these extensively I actually used the older pair just in case you were wondering Peter I use the older pair because while I do like nice shiny new tools I didn't want to look like a noob you know on the job site you look he's got him a new tool uh, so I hadn't tried the new pair yet but I did use these extensively and I did use these are awesome Awesome, awesome little clippers. Focus, focus. Jeez, I guess it's just this nighttime that causes this to do this with my camera. Hold on, there we go. I don't know what the heck. Um, but these were actually awesome, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, but I was able to use these extensively on my last wiring job it takes a minute to get used to using these things i will say uh, it did help because i was in kind of a limited area and you know jerking away with regular clippers but um, after you get the hang of it like when i first started trying it i was like gah, gah. okay now that's working great but um, it actually does a little like tear and bend it so once you get used to doing it where you just put it in the notch and then kind of gently just squeeze a bit just to notch it just like that, they work great. So you do, it does take a little bit of a, a work to figure out how to use it, but these have been awesome. Again, thank you for that. I don't think I ever really appreciate, uh, <laughs> uh, said thank you for that for sure, but let me try this new one. Yes, beautiful. Uh, and actually, I've got another job coming up where I'm going to get a lot of use out of these again. So thanks for that. And then these things have been absolutely wonderful for clipping, uh, like you said, zip ties and uh, other stuff. When I did my wiring management on the last job, those uh, helped a lot with zip ties and also helped clipping the ends of that. So I really appreciate that. However, he has outdone himself yet again. And I mentioned in my last giveaway, I'm going to go ahead and say this now, uh, not to spoil the surprise, but yes, Peter is one of those who is a lucky recipient of a new box coming up. So, Peter, if you're watching, then uh, keep your eyes open for that one day. As soon as I have time to get all the stuff boxed up, I've got a, quite a few little interesting things I'm going to send you. Uh, but in the meantime, let's open up 
Uh, let's see what you sent today. Today, what did you send? A box. A box. And I think this box is Lock Force related again. So let's open her up. Take a look at it. Still have not sharpened my knife. Whoever really said that last time. Yeah, I need to sharpen my knife. Um, so uh, we have, he sent me a picture of all this. So pretty awesome. I don't know what these were in the picture, but they look like terminal blocks. Terminal blocks, which is um, hey, obligatory siren. Obligatory siren. What are these for? What are these for? Get out. Okay, so let me figure this out. Let me see what this is. These are two minutes. Uh, hmm. I am going to figure out what that is. He'll probably update us in the comments, but I'm sure once I figure it out, like little terminal thingamajigger bobbers. Huh, interesting. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna actually Google this. So by the time this video is done and uploaded, I will have figured out what those are for. I make them an actual handy on my next job wiring. I've never used them before, but he sent me a sample. Obviously, this is for heavier to lighter wire. Uh, I don't know. I'll figure that out. Figure that out. I know I've got. I know I've got a big job coming up soon that I'll probably need them for or be able to use them for. Never used them before, but here we go. Check this out, y'all. This is the greatest thing. <laughs> oh, yes. Awesome. What the heck? And a hammer. I got a hammer. I got a little stubby ball peen hammer. Quack, 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 quack. Don't know the significance of that, but... Uh, oh, he's got a letter in here. So I'm going to read the letter off camera, but let's go ahead and open this up. In the, in the letter, it'll probably tell me what those terminal things are for, but this is the best thing ever. Lock Force all the way. I love the Lock Force community. All you guys rock. Different sizes too, check this out. Wait, uh, no, they're all, no, this looks smaller. I guess they are the same, they, they look different. So yes, Kim has a whole new round of shipping to do, ha 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 And uh, really appreciate that. So some of you guys will be getting, uh, guys or girls will be getting another lock for, so oh, look out, look out, that just seems bigger. I guess it's not, I don't know why, it's like a visual thing. Awesome, awesome, thanks so much for that, Peter. Everybody thanks Peter for that. Cause some of you guys and or gals We'll definitely be getting a lock force pin. <laughs> That's great. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yay, lock force. Uh, okay, so let me uh, let me see what these terminal blocks are for real quick. Oh my god, they're wire nuts. That's what he did that for. It's a wire nut. So instead of having to like unscrew or or whatever, you can just, I guess, take it out here. How do you take it out? Do you have to release it? Okay, hold on, I'll figure this out. Maybe what that part's for. Let me get a screwdriver. Oh, uh, I wasn't lifting, I wasn't lifting hard enough. Awesome. So yes, it looks like a it's like a reusable, easy to use wire nut slash uh, butt splice, whatever you want to call them, so that you can use it for temporary connections. You just stick stick one in there and wait, stick one in there and then crimp it down. So actually, this will come in absolute handy for sure. 
I guess you have to shove it further. Yeah, you gotta shove it further in there. So it's like a it's like a temporary wire nut. So if you need to do something for testing or whatever, you just use this instead of having to worry about crimping and uncrimping and recutting. And actually, I yeah, I could have used these. I never even knew these things existed. Um, I could have used these because I did have to splice and unsplice a few uh, connections during my last little job process thing so yes awesome uh, you got me hooked on <laughs> so like you said they're much more expensive than wire nuts but they're much handier so yes these will definitely come in handy now that i know what they're for awesome i'm gonna give them a try you're gonna make me go broke buying fancy wire nuts all the electricians in the house are going to be like "Ooh, look at you with the fancy wire nuts <laughs> i never knew those existed that's pretty cool all right well awesome thanks peter thanks again for the lock force buttons as well we get these we'll get these distributed appropriately uh so yes awesome thank you again appreciate that the earlier gifts as well everything you've sent has definitely gotten some heavy use out of so once again everybody thank peter somebody's going to get some lock force buttons for sure and uh in the meantime uh, we'll catch you tomorrow tomorrow is saturday morning live between 11 and 12 central standard time i'll put up the little graphic somewhere over here make sure and tune in if uh, you're able to uh but again uh, happy Friday. If you're not able to tune in tomorrow, we all have a great weekend and we'll catch you next video. Any questions or comments, as always, put them in the comment section. Lock force. Thanks, Peter.